I have a piece of paper. I didn't make copies of this because our printer was. You don't have to use a symbol. You don't have to use it, but it's a good. It is. It does help your reiki session. It's an empowerment. It it goes like this. Well, show it to him. Show it to everybody. Or I'll go around and show it to you. It go. It's like this. And it even shows on here the direction. What's the name of it? Um, the name of it. You've got my. The reiki symbol. You've got my only paper that shows the name. <laughs> You've got my only paper. Here we go. Show the name. Here. You need this whole package. I just. This is my study packet. And I'll, okay. I'll need it's Choku Ray. Okay. Spell that please. C H O K U R E I. And the pronunciation. Is that what she said? Because you were talking. Visualize that on the first one. <laughs> I was saying it. Do I need Ray. to repeat myself? Uh, yeah, because he was talking, so I didn't hear what you said. It's Cho Ku Ray, and um, the pronunciation is um, the pronunciation of it is C H O E K O O R A Y. That's the pronunciation. Do they have dashes in it, or is it no, no. It's all one word. Yep. Hmm. The meaning of Cho Ku Ray is an empowerment symbol and is used to call down or activate the energy. In Reiki practice, it is also called the delight switch or the first step. The symbol is literally a command for drawing down Reiki from the universal source and should be used as such. It is also an activator for the um, second degree Reiki. Use. Before beginning a healing session, draw the symbol over the client's body in order to activate the second degree energy. That's if you want to go up to second degree. And I've been studying second and master level um, Reiki. Um, as the second degree hand placements follow the first degree, basically your uh, second and third degree Reiki is running um, at these symbols. That's basically what um, what second and third degree is. Isn't there three symbols in second degree? Um, yes. There is. This is the basic empowerment one. This is the basic empowerment one. As the second degree hand placements follow the first degree, you may begin in position one and draw the symbol at the crown chakra at the start. Chuku Rei can also draw on the palms prior to using Reiki over each chakra to cleanse and balance. However, its main use is to increase power in any form. To do this, draw, visualize, or say, Chuku Rei three times. Other uses, protection, cleansing physical spaces, neutralizes chemicals in the air and water, makes food healthier for digestion, clears sick rooms in the hospital, chain charge any object to be used as a healing tool, clear crystals, gemstones, and blessings. And with that, um, I conclude my presentation. Any questions? What?